Once again, my brothers and my sisters, I bring you greetings from the South England Conference. Uh, this week, we want to say a very special thank you to our Pathfinder Director, Pastor Clifford Herman, and his team for executing a successful virtual e -campery. We thank God for the 10 young people who have registered for Bible studies and baptism. Friends, the Holy Spirit is still very active and convicting souls during this pandemic. We praise God. This week, many of our young people are rejoicing as they receive their exam results today. We thank God and commend you for your hard work and efforts, especially during this difficult time. Some will be disappointed because they haven't achieved the grades which will affect their choice of university. But I want to encourage and affirm you, you are not a failure. Simply because you didn't achieve your desired grades, remember, God has not finished with you yet. A setback is an opportunity for you to enter through another open door. So please, don't despair. Don't give up. But press ahead because God hasn't finished with you yet. On Sunday, our South England Conference Public Affairs and Religious Liberty Director, Dr. Brighton Cavallo, led out in a session on mandatory vaccination. Sadly, a number of you were unable to get onto the Zoom platform because we hit the 300 maximum participants. I want to inform you that on the 6th of September at 7 p.m., we will be hosting another presentation which will focus on the South England Conference written evidence to the Government Committee on Human Rights. It will also cover how to identify and avoid conspiracy theories on social media. It will further give an update in the UK of the pros and cons of mandatory vaccination. And finally, it will cover the biblical and spirit of prophecy guidance and principles when considering such a topic. Please be sure and take note of this date and join us for a healthy discussion. Please be advised that there will not be an update in the next few weeks, but as churches begin to reopen, we will come back to you when necessary. Meanwhile, I want to encourage all of you to go out Make disciples for Jesus Christ and build your communities. Please join with me as we pray together. Father, we thank you for your continuous watch care over us. As we embark upon another week, we pray for your presence and your guidance. We seek to develop and build our communities. We seek to grow and impact others for Jesus Christ. We seek to make disciples. So please watch over us and guide us as we endeavor to do the mission of this church. Thank you, Father, for hearing and answering our prayer. In the name of Jesus. Amen.